Hi friends, welcome back to your practice. I am Katie Arnold and today is your mindful slow flow class. We will build some heat within the body while kind of getting into this really mindful meditative place. Now with this slow flow, I want you to be really mindful of where your body is at today. We're not doing anything super crazy. So I just want you to tune in and be really aware of where you're at. This is just a short, about 20 minute long class. So just stay tuned in and really aware of what's going on in your body. If you haven't already, in the description below is a link to my free mindful movement class calendar. It's an entire month long planned out for you based on where your body is at each day to help you kind of learn how to tap into that for yourself, to help you figure out what your body needs every day. It's free. It's in the description below. So grab it. And while you're here, I would be so grateful if you took a moment to like this video, subscribe to my channel. If you are not already, it helps get yoga in front of more people which is one of my greatest missions in this world. Also, if you do enjoy practicing with me, I do have the Studio Connection membership. It's a virtual yoga and meditation studio. All the details are in the link in the description below, but you get to practice with me live. You get longer classes and you have a whole library of 130 plus classes and growing every single month that you have at your disposable and a really great searchable based on how long you have, what you're looking for kind of format. So all the links are in the description below. You don't need any props for this class. So go ahead and roll out your mats and I will meet you there. All right, friends. So we're going to get started lying all the way down on our backs in Supta Baddha Konasana or butterfly on your back. So go ahead and lie all the way down, bringing the soles of your feet together and knees out nice and wide. Let one hand come down onto your belly. Let the other rest gently on your heart. And just start to tune in, tap in. Notice where your body is at here. Notice where your breath is landing. Feel that gentle rise and fall with the breath. Let yourself soften into our practice, knowing that you are safe. Safe to be yourself, safe to practice, safe to tune in. Just starting to notice where everything is landing. Your body, your mind, your energy. And then start to connect in with your ujjayi pranayama breath. So that nose to nose breathing, the inhaling through the nose and the audible exhale back out through the nose. Sounding like ocean waves, inhaling through the nose, exhaling back out through the nose, bringing both of your feet down onto the mat, knees up towards the sky, cross that right ankle over the left thigh, coming into a figure four stretch and just hang right here, keeping that left foot planted, maybe bringing that right hand gently on the inside of that right thigh and just gently guiding that right knee forward towards the front of your space.
And rolling over onto that left side, keeping that figure four position in your legs, letting that right foot plant down on your mat. Right arm comes out of the right shoulder. So we get a nice twist and we get into the IT bands here as well. Inhaling everything back in through center, keeping that figure four legs, bring the hands behind the head. Take a big breath in. Exhale, just crunch up. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, crunch up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, crunch. Two more times with your own breath. Your exhale is your crunch up. Your inhale is the return back down. And uncrossing the legs, recrossing to the other side. So first finding that figure four stretch. Now that left ankle crossed over the right thigh, bringing that left hand on the inside of that left knee and just gently guiding it forward towards the front of the space. And I want you to notice how things change how these gentle adjustments, these gentle self adjustments that we're giving ourselves, maybe even bring just the smallest change to a posture for you. If it's positive and it feels good, keep it. If it doesn't, we let it go, right? So no need to force anything here. And rolling over onto the outside of the right thigh, let the left leg, or excuse me, the left foot plant down on the mat, left arm comes out of the shoulder, right hand on the inside of that left thigh, and once again, gently guiding it forward. And coming back onto your back, keeping that figure four position, hands rest behind the head, gently cradling it. Take a big breath in. Exhale, crunch up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, crunch. That's two. Inhale, lower. We go to five. Exhale, three. Inhale, lower. Exhale, up for four. And final exhale up five. Unwind those legs, bringing the knees into the chest, circle them, taking those circles in both directions, massaging out that low back. And you get to choose how you move out of this pose. So you can start to rock and roll up and down the length of your spine, or if it feels better for your body, just roll over onto one side and press yourself up. So we're gonna all meet in a standing forward fold. So if that rock and roll suits you, you can do that till you can get yourself there. We're just finding the way that we can all meet in this standing forward fold. Feet, hips with distance, maybe a little bit wider. Let those arms hang down heavy. You get to choose if it feels good to sway gently side to side or if you just hang in stillness. I invite you to shake your head yes, shake it no. See if you can release any tension that you might be holding on to in the neck. 
And start to heel toe those feet back to a hips with distance. Press your hands into your shins. Inhale, halfway lift, long spine, flat back. Exhale, we fold forward. Do that again. Inhale, up halfway lift, pull that core in strong. Exhale and fold. One more time. Inhale, up halfway, flat back. Exhale, fold forward. Root down through those feet. Inhale, stand all the way up, sweeping the arms up and overhead. And exhale, pull your hands down through heart center and pause. Take a full round of breath. Inhale, arms sweep up nice and high. Exhale, hinge at your hips, folding forward. Inhale, up halfway lift. Exhale, step the left toes to the back of the mat. Right foot stays forward and soften that knee down to the mat. Inhale, arms reach up high, low lunge. And set up your low lunge for success. Right knee tracking over that right ankle. Energy reaching up through those fingertips, but then soften the shoulders a little bit so they're not hanging out in your ears. Take a big breath in. Exhale, open arm twist. Left arm comes forward, right arm comes back. So really reaching and extending through those arms. Pulling that core in strong. Inhale, reverse, reaching that left arm up and back. And exhale, low twisting lunge. That right hand or that left hand comes on the inside of the right foot. Right arm goes straight up towards the ceiling. Big breath in. Big breath out. One more inhale. Exhale, plant that right hand down. Step it back, downward facing dog. Full round of breath. Inhale, step that left foot forward in between your hands. Right knee softens. Inhale, sweep those arms up, low lunge. Again, set up that foundation, set up that base. Big breath in. Cactus those arms, exhale and open. Inhale, arms reach up. Exhale, bring that right hand down towards that right hip. Take a gentle side body stretch over to the right. Fire up that core here. Inhale, back up through center. Exhale, side bend over towards the left. That left fingertip starts to drop down towards the earth. Inhale it all back up through center. Exhale, hands to the mat. Curl those right toes under. We step to the top of our seat. Inhale, up halfway lift. Exhale, we fold forward. Inhale, root to rise, stand up, sweep those arms high. Exhale, pull the hands down through center, pause. Reconnect. Notice what maybe came up for you. Inhale, sweep those arms high. Exhale, fold forward, hinging at your hips. Inhale, up halfway lift. Exhale, step those right toes back this time. Soften that right knee down. Inhale, sweep up, low lunge. Set up that strong foundation. Engage the core, pull that low belly in. Feel strong and rooted in this foundation. One more big inhale. Exhale, open arm twist to the left. This time that right arm is forward. That left arm is back. We're extending and reaching through those fingertips. Letting that left hand come back to the back of the right thigh. Inhale, reverse, reaching that right arm up and back. 
and exhale, it's a low twisting lunge. Right hand comes down to the mat, left arm reaches high. One more inhale. Exhale, left hand comes down, make your way downward facing dog. Full round of breath. Step that right foot forward, soften that left knee down. Inhale, reach up, low lunge. Take a big breath in. Exhale, cactus those arms, open up that chest. Inhale, arms reach. Exhale, dropping that left hand down towards that left thigh, reach over towards the left. Inhale, both arms back up through center. And exhale, drop that those right fingertips, left arm reaches. Inhale, back up through center. Exhale, hands down to the mat, step to the top, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, long spine. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, root to rise. Exhale, hands down through heart center. Pause. Reconnect. Come back to your breath. Inhale, reach those arms high. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, come down onto a seat on your mat. Crossing those ankles. Hands down on your knees. Lengthen through the spine. Maybe you close your eyes down. And I just want you to sit in this place of stillness, tuning in with your body, noticing how it is you feel right here, noticing what it is that you need, noticing what maybe come up, came up for you through that movement practice. Noticing the ways that you felt strong and empowered. And at the same time, noticing the places where you need to give yourself more grace, where you're still growing, still learning, still navigating. This is a beautiful practice to lead yourself right into a meditation. So if that suits you, you can just stay right here, guiding yourself. Or maybe you complete this practice with me and then go grab one of my meditations you make your way over to the podcast and grab a meditation and journaling prompt to guide you. Hands can stay on your knees or pull them into heart center. Thank you for giving me these 20 minutes of your time to guide you, to walk you through this mindful practice today. I hope you're able to take this feeling of mindfulness, of connectedness to yourself with you through the rest of your day. Om Shanti, peace.
a beautiful day, my friends, and I will see you for our next Flow Friday.